New conversation. Good morning, Mary. Good morning, Michael. How are you today? I am good, thanks. All right, and you? I'm fine too, thanks for asking. Did you find everything you need? Yes, I did. I bought some bread, milk, and eggs. Sounds great. I need to buy some fruit and vegetables. Let's go to the production section together. I need some apples. Of course, I need oranges. They're on sale today. Really? I can have some too. Here they are. They look fresh. I will take a few of these. How about these bananas? These look mature. I'll take some too. Do you need tomatoes or cucumbers? Yes, I do. Let's get some. Okay, we have everything in the production section. What's next? I need some pasta and pasta sauce. Do you like spaghetti? Spaghetti sounds good. Let's find the pasta aisle. Here it is. Which pasta shape do you prefer? I like spaghetti or penne. What about you? I'm going with penne today. Now we need some sauce. I see some tomato sauce and alfredo sauce. Which one do you prefer? I'll go with tomato sauce. It is more versatile. Okay, let's get some tomato sauce then. What else is on your list? I need some rice and beans for the recipe. The rice is right here. Do you prefer white rice or brown rice? I prefer brown rice because of its health benefits. Good choice. Let's get some brown rice. Do you need black beans or kidney beans for your beans? This time I will go with kidney beans. Great. You have everything on your list. Do you need anything else? Just some toilet paper and dish soap. These are in the hallway of the house. Follow me. Thank you, Michael. You have been a great shopping partner. No problem, Mary. It's always nice to catch up while shopping. I agree. Let's go and pay for our food. It looks like a plan. New conversation. Hi, Mary. How are things going at work? I've been pretty busy lately, Michael. All right, and you? I can relate it like this. Things have been busy for me too. Sometimes I need to take a break from everything. That's why we've come to rest here tonight, Mary. You are right, Michael. Let's enjoy our evening. What would you like to drink, Mary? Let me have a glass of white wine, please. I will drink a beer. Bartender, two drinks, please. Thanks, Michael. So, do you have any exciting plans for the weekend? Not really, just a little gardening and reading. It sounds peaceful. I can catch up with my Netflix shows. What are you watching these days? Lately I've been into crime dramas like, Mindhunter. Oh, I watched that too. So busy. I love trying to solve cases with them. Isn't it like a puzzle? Definitely. Speaking of puzzles, how is your puzzle addiction? Haha, ha, still going strong Mary. You gotta teach me some crossword tricks sometime. I will be satisfied. They are quite addictive. Then hello to new puzzle adventures. Cheers, Mary. To friendship and puzzles. So, Michael, have you traveled to an interesting place lately? Not really, work ties me up most of the time. I understand the emotion. The job can be tough. But we have to take time for ourselves, right? We definitely deserve a break. Do you have any travel plans in mind? I'm thinking of taking a beach vacation soon. Sounds great. I love the ocean. The sound of the waves is very soothing. We should plan a trip together sometime. That would be great, Michael. Let's make it happen, Mary. I'm in. We'll have to find the perfect spot.
Maybe a place with great seafood. You know me very well, Michael. You are a seafood lover. Guilty as alleged. Ha ha. I couldn't be otherwise, Mary. Cheers to seafood and future adventures. Cheers, Mary. To a great friendship. So Michael, is there a big project involved? We are launching a new product next month. Exciting. What is all this about? It is a software solution for data analytics. Influential. This is a growing field. Yes, and the team is working hard on it. I can guess the pressure, but you'll make it. Thanks Mary. Your trust means a lot. We've been through a lot together, Michael. That's right, and we've always had each other's backs. Cheers to teamwork and success. Cheers, Mary. To many more victories. So, Michael, do you have any new hobbies lately? I considered painting as a creative outlet. This is great. What kind of art do you create? For now it's mostly landscapes and summaries. I would love to see your work one day, Michael. I'm going to show you some pictures on my phone. I'm looking forward to it. Creativity is refreshing. It's a great stress reliever, Mary. I have to find a creative hobby too. You become perfect in anything you put your mind to. Thanks for the vote of confidence, Michael. Always, Mary. You can do anything. Salute to creativity and endless possibilities. Cheers, Mary. To our unlimited potential. So, Michael, any news about the family? My son just entered college, Mary. This is a very important milestone. Congratulations. Thanks, it's a proud moment for me. I can guess. Time flies, right? It really is. Appreciate every moment. I will, Michael. Family is everything. Definitely Mary. They are our support system. Cheers to the family and their unwavering love. Cheers, Mary. The tortoise that never breaks. So, Michael, are there any exciting books you've read? I just finished a gripping thriller. Want to share the title? I need a good read. It's called, Silent Witness. Highly recommended. I will add it to my list thanks for your suggestion. Tell me how you love it, Mary. I will, Michael. We have similar tastes. That's why we make such great friends, Mary. Cheers to good books and shared interests. Cheers, Mary. To our eternal friendship. So Michael, do you have a retirement plan? Not soon, Mary. I still enjoy working. Retirement is a big step, a whole new chapter. I guess I'll find out when the time comes. You will have more time for puzzles. Ha ha. You're right about that, Mary. And of course our beach holidays. Retirement sounds tempting when you phrase it that way. That's the reward for years of hard work, Michael. Cheers to the future and the adventures it holds. Cheers, Michael. To embrace those who come our way. So Mary, any exciting news for you? I'm getting a new puppy next week. That's great news, Mary. Which breed? This is a Labrador Retriever. I'm so excited. The workers are very friendly and loyal. I can't wait to have a furry friend by my side. It will be a great addition to your life. Cheers to new beginnings and puppy love. Cheers, Mary. Enjoy pet companionship. So, Michael, are there places to travel on your to-do list? I've always wanted to visit Japan, Mary. Japan is a beautiful country with a rich culture. Yes, its history and cuisine fascinates me. It's on my list too. Maybe we can go together.
That would be an amazing adventure, Mary. To dream big and explore the world. Cheers, Mary. To make our travel dreams come true. So, Michael, how's your golf game these days? I haven't played in a while, Mary. It's an intense program. Golf is a very relaxing sport. To put my mind at ease, I must get back to the topic. Let me know when you do. I will join you. This seems like a fun idea, Mary. Cheers to future rounds of golf and laughter. Cheers, Mary. To perfect our swing. So Michael, do you have any advice for a successful career? Stay dedicated. Work hard and be adaptable. Wise words, Michael. You've had a great career. It's all about constant growth, Mary. You are an inspiration to many, including me. I appreciate that, Mary. We can all reach our goals. Glory to your ambition and reaching for the stars. Cheers, Mary. Unlimited opportunities to the sky. New conversation. Good morning, Mary. Good morning, Michael. How are you today? I am good, thanks. All right, and you? I am also good. Did you sleep well last night? Yes, I did. I slept like a baby. That's great to hear. What would you like for breakfast? Let me have some cereal, please. Okay, I'll get it for you. Thank you, Michael. You're welcome. Would you like some coffee? Yes, please. Black coffee, no sugar. I understand. Did you watch the news yesterday? No, I missed it. What happened? A big fire broke out in the city center. This is terrible. Yes, it was. Many people lost their homes. I feel sorry for them. Me too. We should help if we can. Definitely. Here's your cereal and coffee. Thanks again. You're welcome. Enjoy your breakfast. I will do it. What are your plans for today? I have to go to work at 10 o'clock. What time is it? 8. You have some time left. Yes, I do. I'll help with the dishes. You are very kind. Teamwork makes dreams come true. Actually, are you ready for work? Almost I just need to get my bag. Don't forget your lunch. Thanks for packing it for me. No problem. Have a nice day. You too, Michael. See you tonight. I'm looking forward to it. Goodbye for now. Bye. Hello, Mary. How was your day? Hi, Michael. It was busy but fine. That's great to hear. How was your day? It was true. I have had many meetings. Meetings can be tiring. Yes, they can. What's for dinner tonight? I was thinking of making pasta. Sounds delicious. I'll start cooking soon. Can I help with anything? You can also set the table if you want. Of course I can do that. Thanks, Mary. You're welcome. Dinner has been served. This place smells amazing. I'm glad you think so. Let's eat. Enjoy your meal. This pasta is great. I am glad you like it. Did you add some herbs in it? Yes, I added basil and thyme. It gives a good taste. I learned this from my grandmother. He must be a great cook. He. We should invite him sometime. That sounds good. I will call him tomorrow. Thanks, Mary. No problem. Do you want some dessert? I'm so full right now. Maybe later. Definitely. How was your weekend, Mary? It was comforting. I watched a film. That sounds good. What about you? I went for a walk with some friends. How was the walk? It was challenging but fun. I'm not much a hiker. This is not for everyone. I prefer a quiet day at home. 
This is fine. What are our plans for the evening? We can watch movies together. It looks like a plan. Which type do you prefer? I like romantic comedies. I can find one for us. Great. I'll make popcorn too. You are thinking of everything. I'm just trying to make it special. You are sweet. I will do my best. The film was very funny. I'm glad you liked it. Thanks for the popcorn too. Anytime. What time is it? It's getting late, around 11 o'clock. I should get some sleep. I will escort you to your room. This is very polite behavior. I'm just looking for you. Good night, Michael. Good night, Mary. Michael, would you pass me the salt? Of course you are. Thanks. You're welcome. Michael, do you have any plans for the weekend? Not really, I was thinking of calming down. That sounds good. Maybe we can go for a walk in the park. This is a good idea. I need some fresh air. Perfect. Let's plan for Saturday afternoon. It looks like a plan. What time should we meet? How about 2 in the afternoon? 2 p.m. works for me. See you later. See you on Saturday. Mary, have you ever been to the new cafe downtown? No, I did not. Is it a good thing? I heard it's really beautiful. Would you like to try it with me this weekend? This seems like a fun idea, Michael. What day and time were you thinking of? How about around 3 p.m. on a Sunday afternoon? It works for me at 3 p.m. on a Sunday. I'm looking forward to this. Great. It's a date. Michael, I have exciting news to share. What happened Mary? I got promoted at work today. Wow, that's great news. Congratulations Mary. Thank you very much Michael. I am really happy with that. You worked hard for this and you deserve it. I appreciate your support, Michael. Let's celebrate this weekend. Dinner is on me. Sounds great, Michael. I can't wait. Mary, do you have any plans for summer vacation? Not yet, Michael. I'm still deciding where to go. How about a beach trip? We can relax and sunbathe. This sounds very tempting. Which beach are you considering? There's a very nice one about four hours away. It's called Seaside Beach. Then Seaside Beach is it. Let's plan for July. It's July. I will start looking for a place to stay. Thanks Michael. This will be a great vacation. I can't wait to go to the beach with you, Mary. Michael, it's been a long time since I went to the museum. How about a visit this weekend? That's a great idea, Mary. I love art and history. Wonderful. We can go on Saturday morning. The museum opens at 10 a.m. It looks like a plan. I'll pick you up at 9 in the morning. Perfect. I will be ready. I look forward to exploring the museum with you. It will be an educational and fun day, Michael. Mary, have you ever tried to cook Italian food? No, I haven't, but I would love to learn. How about an Italian cooking night this weekend? Seems like a fun idea. What Italian dish should we cook? Let's make homemade pizza. It's easy and delicious. Then this is homemade pizza. When should I come? How about 1800 on Saturday? 1800 works for me. I'll bring some wine. Great. It's going to be a delicious evening, Mary. I can't wait to cook and enjoy pizza with you, Michael. Mary, do you have any plans for the long weekend? Not yet. Michael, do you have any suggestions? How about a day trip to the mountains for some hiking and fresh air? 
Seems like a great idea. When should we go? The long weekend starts on Friday. We can go on Saturday morning. Saturday morning it is. I will prepare a picnic. It will be an unforgettable day, Mary. I'm excited to explore the mountains with you, Michael. Mary, what kind of music do you like? I enjoy listening to all kinds of music, from pop to classical. That's great to hear. How about going to the concert this weekend? I would love that, Michael. Who is performing? A jazz band plays on Saturday night. Interested? I've always wanted to attend a jazz concert. Count me too. Wonderful. I'll buy the tickets and we can have dinner before the concert. It's going to be a great evening, Michael. I can't wait to enjoy great music with you, Mary. Michael, what do you like to do on a rainy day? I enjoy reading a good book or watching a movie at home. It sounds comfortable. How about we have a movie marathon this weekend? I'm ready for it, Mary. What type of movies do you prefer? How about a mix of comedy and suspense? It looks like a plan. I'll bring some snacks. It's going to be a relaxing day, Michael. I'm looking forward to our movie marathon, Mary. Michael, do you like outdoor activities? Yes I do. I enjoy walking and cycling. Great. Let's go on a bike tour this weekend. I haven't ridden a bike for a while. Where should we go? There is a beautiful path by the river. We can start from there. Looks like a regenerative plan, Mary. What time should we meet? Let's meet at 10 o'clock on Sunday. Sunday morning at 10. I will bring my bike. It will be a fun journey, Michael. I'm excited to hit the road with you, Mary. Michael, have you ever been to the zoo in our city? No, I haven't been, but I would love to go. How about visiting the zoo this weekend? This seems like a great idea, Mary. What day should we go? Saturday works for me. Weather looks good. Saturday it is. I'll get the tickets. I can't wait to see all the animals with you, Michael. It's going to be an exciting day, Mary. Michael, do you enjoy cooking together? I want Mary. This is very funny. How would you like to try making sushi this weekend? Sushi sounds delicious. I've never done it before. It's not very difficult and I can show you the basics. This looks like a plan. When should I come? How about 1700 on Saturday? 5 p.m. works for me. I'm looking forward to this. This is going to be a sushi-making adventure, Michael. I can't wait to have some sushi with you, Mary. Michael, do you like going to the theater? Yes I do. I enjoy live performances. How about watching a play this weekend? This seems like a great idea, Mary. What is the game about? It's a classic comedy and I've heard it's really funny. Comedy sounds great. What time does the play start? The game starts at 1900 on Saturday. 7 p.m. works for me. I will book the tickets. It's going to be a fun evening, Michael. I'm excited to watch the play with you, Mary. Michael, how about going on a picnic this weekend? Picnic sounds good, Mary. Where should we go? There is a beautiful park with a lake nearby. Perfect for picnic. Looks like a great place. What day should we go? Around 1 p.m. on a Sunday afternoon should be perfect. Sunday at 1300. I'll make some sandwiches. It's going to be a relaxing day at the park, Michael. I'm looking forward to our picnic, Mary.
Michael, have you ever been to an art gallery? Yes, I've been to a few. I appreciate the art. How about visiting the art gallery in the city center this weekend? That's a great idea, Mary. What day should we go? Perfect Saturday morning. The gallery opens at 10 a.m. Saturday at 10 a.m. I look forward to seeing some art with you. It's going to be an inspiring morning, Michael. I look forward to exploring the art gallery with you, Mary. Michael, do you like going to live music concerts? Yes, I do. Live music is always a great experience. How about going to a rock concert this weekend? A rock concert sounds exciting, Mary. Who is performing? A local band plays on Saturday night. It should be fun. Saturday night it is. I'll get the tickets. It's going to be an unforgettable night, Michael. I can't wait to have fun with you, Mary. Michael, have you ever tried paddleboarding? No, I didn't, but it looks like fun. How would you like to try it at the lake this weekend? Paddleboarding sounds adventurous, Mary. When should we go? Let's meet at the lake around 11 o'clock on Sunday. Sunday at 11 a.m. I'm excited to try paddleboarding. It's going to be a great day on the water, Michael. I look forward to paddleboarding with you, Mary. Michael, do you enjoy cooking international cuisine? Yes, I do. It's always exciting to try new dishes. How about making Thai curry this weekend? Thai curry sounds delicious, Mary. I've never done it before. It's not very difficult and I can show you the recipe. This looks like a plan. When should I come? How about 1800 on Saturday? 1800 works for me. I can't wait to try the Thai curry. It's going to be a delicious evening, Michael. I can't wait to cook with you and enjoy Thai curry, Mary. Michael, have you ever been to a comedy show? Yes, I have. I love a good laugh. How about going to a comedy club this weekend? Comedy club sounds great, Mary. Who is performing? A famous comedian takes the stage on Saturday night. It must be so funny. Saturday night it is. I'll get the tickets. It's going to be a night of laughter, Michael. I can't wait to enjoy some comedy with you, Mary. Michael, do you like to visit historical places? Yes, I do. I find history fascinating. How about going to the historical museum this weekend? That's a great idea, Mary. What day should we go? Perfect on a Saturday afternoon. The museum has amazing exhibits. It's Saturday afternoon. I will be ready. It will be an educational and interesting visit, Michael. I look forward to exploring history with you, Mary. Michael, have you ever tried paddleboarding? No, I didn't, but it looks like fun. How would you like to try it at the lake this weekend? Paddleboarding sounds adventurous, Mary. When should we go? Let's meet at the lake around 11 o'clock on Sunday. Sunday at 11 a.m. I'm excited to try paddleboarding. It's going to be a great day on the water, Michael. I look forward to paddleboarding with you, Mary. Michael, do you enjoy cooking international cuisine? Yes, I do. It's always exciting to try new dishes. How about making Thai curry this weekend? Thai curry sounds delicious, Mary. I've never done it before. It's not very difficult and I can show you the recipe. This looks like a plan. When should I come? How about 1800 on Saturday? 1800 works for me.
I can't wait to try the Thai curry. It's going to be a delicious evening, Michael. I can't wait to cook with you and enjoy Thai curry, Mary. Michael, have you ever been to a comedy show? Yes, I have. I love a good laugh. How about going to a comedy club this weekend? Comedy club sounds great, Mary. Who is performing? A famous comedian takes the stage on Saturday night. It must be so funny. Saturday night it is. I'll get the tickets. It's going to be a night of laughter, Michael. I can't wait to enjoy some comedy with you, Mary. Michael, do you like to visit historical places? Yes, I do. I find history fascinating. How about going to the historical museum this weekend? That's a great idea, Mary. What day should we go? Perfect on a Saturday afternoon. The museum has amazing exhibits. It's Saturday afternoon. I will be ready. It will be an educational and interesting visit, Michael. I look forward to exploring history with you, Mary. Michael, have you ever tried paddleboarding? No, I didn't, but it looks like fun. How would you like to try it at the lake this weekend? Paddleboarding sounds adventurous, Mary. When should we go? Let's meet at the lake around 11 o'clock on Sunday. Sunday at 11 a.m. I'm excited to try paddleboarding. It's going to be a great day on the water, Michael. I look forward to paddleboarding with you, Mary. Michael, do you enjoy cooking international cuisine? Yes, I do. It's always exciting to try new dishes. How about making Thai curry this weekend? Thai curry sounds delicious, Mary. I've never done it before. It's not very difficult and I can show you the recipe. This looks like a plan. When should I come? How about 1800 on Saturday? 1800 works for me. I can't wait to try the Thai curry. It's going to be a delicious evening, Michael. I can't wait to cook with you and enjoy Thai curry, Mary. Michael, have you ever been to a comedy show? Yes, I have. I love a good laugh. How about going to a comedy club this weekend? Comedy club sounds great, Mary. Who is performing? A famous comedian takes the stage on Saturday night. It must be so funny. Saturday night it is. I'll get the tickets. It's going to be a night of laughter, Michael. I can't wait to enjoy some comedy with you, Mary. Michael, do you like to visit historical places? Yes, I do. I find history fascinating. How about going to the historical museum this weekend? That's a great idea, Mary. What day should we go? Perfect on a Saturday afternoon. The museum has amazing exhibits. It's Saturday afternoon. I will be ready. It will be an educational and interesting visit, Michael. I look forward to exploring history with you, Mary. Michael, have you ever tried paddleboarding? No, I didn't, but it looks like fun. How would you like to try it at the lake this weekend? Paddleboarding sounds adventurous, Mary. When should we go? Let's meet at the lake around 11 o'clock on Sunday. Sunday at 11 a.m. I'm excited to try paddleboarding. It's going to be a great day on the water, Michael. I look forward to paddleboarding with you, Mary. Michael, do you enjoy cooking international cuisine? Yes, I do. It's always exciting to try new dishes. How about making Thai curry this weekend? Thai curry sounds delicious, Mary. I've never done it before. It's not very difficult and I can show you the recipe. This looks like a plan. 
when should I come? How about 1800 on Saturday? 1800 works for me. I can't wait to try the Thai curry. It's going to be a delicious evening, Michael. I can't wait to cook with you and enjoy Thai curry, Mary. Michael, have you ever been to a comedy show? Yes, I have. I love a good laugh. How about going to a comedy club this weekend? Comedy club sounds great, Mary. Who is performing? A famous comedian takes the stage on Saturday night. It must be so funny. Saturday night it is. I'll get the tickets. It's going to be a night of laughter, Michael. I can't wait to enjoy some comedy with you, Mary. Michael, do you like to visit historical places? Yes I do. I find history fascinating. How about going to the historical museum this weekend? That's a great idea, Mary. What day should we go? Perfect on a Saturday afternoon. The museum has amazing exhibits. It's Saturday afternoon. I will be ready. It will be an educational and interesting visit, Michael. I look forward to exploring history with you, Mary. Michael was a great weekend full of fun activities. Yes, it did, Mary. I had a great time with you. Me too, Michael. Let's plan more adventures together. Definitely Mary. I'm looking forward to this. New conversation. Hi Mary. How was your day? It was fine, thanks. I had a few lessons today. Michael, do you have any plans for the weekend? Not really, maybe I'll study and hang out with my friends. All right, and you? Mary, can you help me with this math problem? Of course, I'd be happy to help. What problem are you stuck on? Michael, haven't you decided on your major yet? Not yet. I'm still exploring different options. All right, and you? What is your industry? Mary, would you like to have lunch together after class? Sounds great, Michael. I'm hungry. Let's go to the campus cafe. New conversation. Hello, Mary. How are you today? Hi, Michael. I'm fine like that, thanks. All right, and you? I'm fine, thanks for asking. Can I buy you a drink? Of course a glass of white wine would be nice. The perfect choice. I will take the same. Cheers. Cheers. So how are things going for you? I've been very busy lately, but I'm managing. I understand the job can be tough at times. Yes, definitely. All right, and you? How is your job? It's going well. I have new projects that excite me. That's great to hear. What are you working on? I'm working on a marketing campaign for a new product. Sounds interesting. Tell me a little more about that. We're targeting a younger demographic with this. This is a smart move. Young customers are important. Definitely. So how is your family? Any news? My son graduated from university last month. Congratulations. This is a big turning point. Yes, we are very proud of him. I can guess. What is the branch? He specialized in business. This is impressive. He has to go after his father. I want to think so. What about your family? They're doing well, thank you. My daughter is getting married soon. This is exciting news. Have you started planning a wedding? Yes, we have. It will be a small and intimate ceremony. These may be the most memorable ones. I agree. So, do you have a vacation plan for you this year? We are thinking of going to Europe in the summer. Europe sounds great. Where specifically? We are considering Italy or France. Both are great choices. 
The food will be incredible. Definitely. We love to try new cuisines. Me too. It was nice to catch up, Michael. You too, Mary. Let's do this again soon. Definitely. Good evening. You too. Goodbye for now. New conversation. Good morning, Mary. How are you today? Good morning, Michael. I am good, thanks. All right, and you? I'm great, thank you. Did you have a chance to review the project proposal? Yes, I did. It looks good overall, but there are a few points I'd like to discuss. Sure, let's skip them. What concerns do you have? First of all, the timeline seems a bit cramped. Can we extend the deadline for a week? This is a valid point. I'll talk to the team and see if we can make adjustments. Great. Secondly, I noticed some inconsistencies in the budget section. Can you specify which parts need clarification? Sure. On page 3, under hardware costs. The numbers don't match. I see this now. Thanks for catching this. I will fix it right away. You're welcome finally. Do we have a backup plan in case of technical problems? Yes we do. We have a contingency plan for such situations. Great. This is reassuring. How is the team's progress on coding tasks? They are making good progress and we are well on our way to reaching our milestones. Good to hear. Let's be careful to keep communication between teams open. Acceptance. Communication is key to the success of this project. By the way, have we scheduled the client meeting for next week? Yes, it's set to 10 o'clock on Tuesday. I will send the invitations today. Perfect. Until then, I will prepare the presentation materials. Thanks Mary. You are doing a great job managing this project. Thank you Michael. It's a team effort and I appreciate your support. Teamwork is absolutely essential for our success. Anything else to discuss? Not now. Let's continue to monitor our progress and resolve issues promptly. Acceptance. Thanks Mary for the fruitful discussion. Thank you too Michael. Have a nice day. You too, Mary. Goodbye for now.